my car got stolen. Specifically on the 28th of November, I went to a restaurant in Maitama Abuja. Shogun restaurant, guys, at Lake Chad Crescent, owned by Sinclair. Uh, my friend told me to go try out their Chinese, so why not? I mean, in a restaurant hopper. I went there, got there at 7.10 p.m., coming from my office, I'm tired, I'm hungry, I ordered starters. In fact, I told them to do the main course takeout because I wanted to get home. Precisely like around like 8.30 p.m., I was ready to go. I mean, an acquaintance of mine met up with me and had a few conversations. The next thing, I couldn't find my car key. The Range Rover, by the way. So I'm like, what's going on? It's keyless. I emptied my bag, tossed the table, couldn't find the key. I called the waiter, oh, did you see my key? I didn't see my key. I checked upstairs where I tried to sit down before I didn't see the key. I mean, I called the attention of the management. I told them I was looking for my key. They were like, so sorry. I'm like, okay, worst case scenario, because my acquaintance is like, oh, let's just go. Maybe it fell somewhere. I'm like, okay, hopefully maybe the cleaners get it, find it tomorrow in the morning when there's daylight or whatever i would just have to come and see how to get a tow truck because at this point it's like 8 30 to 9 and i felt like i mean it was packed pretty securely right in front of the security post so i felt like it was good so i went home only to return the next morning at 8 40 a.m and my car was not there now this is where it gets really interesting given that i told the management of this place i told them my car key was missing imagine getting to this place where i packed my car and it wasn't there like i looked for my car in the drainage first i thought like maybe maybe somebody helped me pack it at the backyard let me check inside like am i like what is going on and then the saddest part of it all was really how they treated me at that place because when i got there i'm like where is my car i was like oh we don't know it was here overnight in fact it was here till morning they just handed over to us this morning i said at what point did you stop seeing the car and the security personnel said the car was there all night it was when they were changing shift at what 6 30 to 7 a.m and they saw somebody driving off can you imagine the nonchalance? Then I called the attention of the management. I'm like, my car, I told you guys the key was missing and I was going to try and get the spare key from Lagos and see what I can do. So what's going on? And they're like, oh, we don't know what you're talking about, really. Um, The car, we, yes, you told us your car key was missing. We did not know you left the car here. I'm like, what does that mean? If my car key is missing. How am I supposed to move the car? Like, these people made me feel so stupid. Guys, like, I sat down outside in that restaurant. Like, I was looking up. Like, my life flashed before my eyes. I was just like, what the hell is going on? Am I in a movie? I stood there. They didn't even have the courtesy to even call, like, proper management. The owner didn't even show up or someone in higher authority and the whole time i was there they're like oh, we don't know we don't understand nobody was giving me answers guys i was standing for over two hours and then you know the funny part at some point the manager was telling me oh I look at everybody here they didn't see any key everybody here is a good staff yes i went to the police and trust me honey if you don't take anything out of this story you see in nigeria avoid trouble nothing much was done security personnel was brought in detained questioned of course everybody claimed i don't know I this restaurant that i paid a bill of what 84k for two persons meal and um, that even has patronage of what expatriates do you know they did not have CCTV? They couldn't show me CCTV footage. So this place has a setup where there's a restaurant outside and then there's a guest house, whatever. There, there is no CCTV. There is no security footage covering the entrance of this place. I'm sure hence why they have on foot security personnel. But what happened? Nobody saw anything. The way I cried eh? I don't even know what I was crying. The title of my cry. Of course, I've never lost something so big. It's in how irresponsible they made me look. It's in how stupid they made me feel. 
how did the car just disappear? How? I'm sure some people are like, why didn't I say all this? I'm like, I was too stunned. It's not everything that happens to you. Run too quickly. Like, the shock I was going through. I didn't have time to think of where my phone button was. But yeah, guess what? It was found. I'll tell you how. You have family. So I'm just going who to called you? Okay. Mm -hmm. He called you. So when he called you, you didn't ask him that. Whoa, this guy is big. Old. How come? He called me. He told me that he found the key. So he missed the key. He told me about it. And then he told me about six years ago. Six months ago. After the job. So I just have to go back. So my question to you, I just want to know something. Why did you take the key? I want to understand why. I want to understand what was going through your mind. Okay, that's why he became a robbery. Okay, that's why he became a left I'm robbery. He left it to me. The lady won't be seen on listening to the story won't be said she told now just now. Now one of our reality TV star when they call princess now come herself for social media or Konyano Zio Kwata of how he be said it is still in car when they call Rich Rover for one Chinese restaurant when be said she go for Abuja. If not be smart it they happen no. The rate at which people think they lost their things now for Nigeria now let God never be say go saving children. My question be say, from what in BC she talk, she see the Chinese restaurant not get CCTV camera for outside the restaurant to take no what in BC happen to her car. Even from the story when BC she talk, she see that for when BC she for sit down, when BC she get up, now she notice see the car keys when BC she carry come up for her. So if at all say the restaurant not get CCTV camera for outside of the restaurant to take no high ABC the car till work out. How come you can't be say even for inside the restaurant CCTV camera not there to take capture the moment the time will be say person take carry the thief the car keys come off for a hand. Mo could not still forget say say the way we say Chinese restaurants take carry the hate most of our Nigeria sisters and brothers eh? forget about the fact say they be Chinese restaurants, they be foreign restaurants for Nigeria. Many at times say eh? not only the money they did, but they don't even care about the well being of our Nigeria sister and brother. Some of our Nigeria sisters and brothers will say they for all these Chinese countries. Eh? Many of all the Chinese restaurants will be say they for the Chinese countries, eh? they know they would allow our fellow brothers and sisters say, to who eat for the restaurant when we see the gates. Anyway, people, for this particular video, when we see princess come myself for social media to take talk our story. Many people not even believe her, say, so they talk, say, and eh, sugar that in NBC fed by the Range Rover for her at the first place. No need for her not to come begin the commerce for social media, not the cry for what NBC happened to her. Why some people not even get compassionate towards her story? Now, for there, some people see they will be see they understand where BC princess would they come because. Now only person will be say don't lose something we say they important to run. Now he be say go understand the feelings for you will be say princess from the come. And I thank God for this princess Mata say at last at last she see see the people won't be say thief the car. And what will be say you think say go be the right punishment when they go give all these people won't be say the cash seen and then be the person won't be say they responsible for the thiefing of the Range Rover won't be say our reality TV star when they call princess get. Any woman people make you let me know what TBC you get for this matter for the comment section below. If you never subscribe, try to do so until I see you for my next video. Bye bye.